Welcome back, everybody, to more Stone Hearth here on Additional Pilots Games. We're continuing where we left off with Gwar Haracho. Um, as soon, basically, as soon as I shut off the last episode, um, we had a couple invaders come in. So was, we had some wolves that came in and invaded the town. We also had a, a goblin camp up here that we had to take care of. So our fighters, our warriors, have a little bit more experience. You can see, they're also a little bit injured. Um, good thing we got this herbalist going. Our herbalist also leveled up, but we don't have the ingredients for bandages at the moment. So we'll have to take care of that. We do need to improve our our net worth to 2200 in order to attract our next hearthling. So we're going to be working on that today. So I'm thinking that let's go ahead and start building this little platform that I was talking about. We'll make it out of making everything else out of click rank, so let's just continue it. We'll have a little 4x4 four four platform. Let's go ahead and give it up. Um, give it some stone supports. Make it look like it's actually... Actually, first, we need to give it a... Let's see this. So our other platform is too thick as well. So let's make sure that this is too thick, two blocks thick, to clarify. I don't know, I just think that's a, I like that color. Let's go ahead with this lighter we use. We just use light ash. That's better. So now it looks like it's got uh, you know, some pillars for support. So let's go with that. There we go. Let's get that platform going. Let's also get our craftsman working on some more items. Definitely want some of these. Potter, let's get you working on as many of these teapots as we can build. Give our economy a little boost. Okay, we've got some wolves over here. How are our troops doing? One of them's a little injured. That's okay. We should be fine. It's only two wolves. We fought off three wolves in our last episode, so we should be good. Both our troops are now speedy, so we got Speedy Creed and Speedy Lyzra. Coming at you. There we go. Flipping level 3 for Speedy Creed. There it is. Enemy destroyed. Nice job, ladies. Take those wolf pelts. here in order to complete this ladder to do that. I'm don't thinking that we're going to get to our 2200 in time, unless, well, maybe we will. Only got one left, so let's build a table. Do a preliminary harvest here to try and get up to that le next level. Next level of uh, yeah, we're gonna do it. There we go. Let's see if that works a little better this time. Get our hard things to clear this off. Troops are healing up. And let's go ahead and order you. Even if you don't have the ingredients for it right now, we'll just put that in the queue. And put that above. 
Thomas. Caravan approaches. Yeah, that's a good trade. Take that. Workers are sleeping right now. Alright. So the other thing that we can do, just to kind of lay out our lay out our town a little bit. So we'll build a road. Like so uh, that's incorrect. We need a road, not blocks. So this comes in right there, forward. Yes, we can start building. Yes. Reina Sardis. Reina is pretty average in every way. <laughs> average to below average, unfortunately. At least as far as statistics. She's still a special snowflake. She's just not that useful. For craftsmen or for fighters. So. Building appears to have stopped here. Um, and we don't have enough stone, which means I think it's time that we. This lines up perfectly, actually, with this. So we're going to build our mine. Hopefully, the mining tool, it does not. Unbelievable. Alright. Well, that looks pretty cool, anyways. So we'll do it like this. It's time that we start mining in, into here anyways. So we're going to get plenty of stone from this. Our things still have not done everything I wanted them to do with this. They haven't done anything with it. Again, another reason why I prefer to just mine out layer by layer. So build that. What do we find? Okay, so basically they're just mining as far as they need to to get this, get a piece of stone. Then they use that piece of stone to build out here, which is fine. Whatever. Start taking out these low areas. Lunchtime. Lunchtime. Alright. Road's going in. Looking pretty good. This got started. Sort of. Not really. Scaffolding's there. Take a look at the mine. Nothing special at the moment. that and I'm thinking that it's time that we could turn one of you into a farmer. Naraya. Welcome to farming. Yes. So we've got Runa Quality who's farmer level five. And I wonder if that enables acacia trees. Does perfect. So let's get those saplings going. ASAP. Get two of them. And that'll be good for now. Okay, didn't find anything. That's alright. I think that this is a good place for us to build a little central chamber. 24 by 24 room, and then we'll <coughs> carve out. We'll figure out what we do with the rest of the mountain later. But that's a nice little central chamber. 
might be where we have our like our valuables stored or something like that. So we'll go with it. <laughs> this does mean that we'll have to leave these pillars. I'm thinking that what we'll do actually is we'll just build manually build our own pillars in front of this. So we'll tear down all this stuff like we have been, like we did over on this side. Speaking of which, let's go ahead and get rid of that. So we'll man manually build our own pillars so that we can just have a, a single stone door that leads into there. So that'll be good. That will be good. Net worth is steadily rising, but I don't think that we're going to have enough for whoever wants to join us next. But let's get some. Get these urns down for some storage there. And yeah, we'll put our we'll put some we'll put the stone chests into that into that room. Let's go ahead. And put down a couple beds. And a couple lamps. Right there. For now. Looks good. Um meh. No thanks. Alright, it's bedtime for most people. Bedtime at 4.30 in the morning. Right. For whatever reason, they don't want to build this. Which is unfortunate. Okay, we've got Varanus. stone. Let's get our mason open. So we get five more of those. Mr. Potter. Not a whole lot for you at the moment. Herbalist. Like she's all caught up with her work. Harvest all of those plants. Looks like it probably loops around, so we'll have to get to that here in a little bit. Um, so these cacti are starting to bloom again, and what else can we place around town? Chests we're going to be placing indoors. So let's go ahead. Just a basic house. A little clay house. I haven't really made use of many of the templates, so. Let's go ahead and just build a little, a little house right here on the corner. 
actually, that brings up a better discussion of where where we're going to put everything. So obviously, a market district means that we're going to be putting shops around here, stores, craftsmen, that sort of thing. We've got the our storage vault in here, uh, town square. So I'm thinking that housing will be we'll have some housing over here. Put some, or we can do housing right in this area, which is what I'm thinking we'll do. So have housing here. This will lead up to like watchtower, you know, watchtower here, something there, I don't know. Lighthouse. So let's lay out our road system first. And then we'll get into laying out where our houses are going to be. Let's try to it's a little too close to the edge. Go ahead and take a couple blocks off this. Just give us a little bit more room towards the edge, just in case we want to put something there. Same. Let's do that. And that, and then we'll build a nice little road section. Maybe we'll put like a little park or a garden or something like that. There. That's. Yes, start building. Everybody starts scurrying. Alright. That's good. Give our workers something to do. Let's also go ahead and place some of these chests. Alright, little vault. stone to build our road trader approaches no thanks all right so we've only got four workers right now so i think one of the mistakes that i made in the last playthrough with great lights hollow is i put too many made too many troops um, i had seven seven soldiers i think that five is probably a good number We'll just have to see. I'm also thinking that last time I didn't, I wasn't able to make use of engineer, which I think would be helpful for fending off enemies and uh, allowing us to. So we have one engineer who's able to set up traps and able to set up little turrets and stuff, and cover, basically, automate our defense a little bit. So we're gonna try and do that as well. We'll have to make a road that comes out. Kind of zigzags a little bit. Here, back, here again. Build. This is nice. Uh, we might make it. We're gonna make it. So we'll get ourselves another hearthling. Once our once our hearthling shows up, that'll be the next episode. I've been going a little bit over in the last two episodes, just a few minutes longer than I want to. So let's. Our thing arrives at 8 o'clock. So yeah, we definitely made it. Good stuff. Nothing like a good building project to uh, attract some people to Guajaracho. We have Alora Creed, sister of Speedy Creed. Uh, also, hmm, not sure what to do with you. Above average on body and spirit, but also level 5 mind. Which would be good for a craftsperson. Craftling. Craftling. That's right. 
can remember our correct terminology. This little platform looks like it's not going to get built. Something that what we're going to do is we're going to cancel this. That was very satisfying. We'll cancel it and we'll take care of. Uh, I'll try and figure that off out off screen. Um, so, but I'll do that while we're away. So, thanks again for tuning in for some more Hearthstone. Hearthstone. Stone Hearth. Jeez. More Stone Hearth here on Additional Pilots Games. Hit like and subscribe if you want some more. Check out some of the other series going on on the channel. Leave a comment below if you have anything, anything to say, and uh, I'll check it out. So, thanks again for tuning in, and we'll see you next time here on Additional Pilots Games.